Today, I'm announcing the United States is prepared to commit more than $1 billion in humanitarian assistance to help get relief to millions of Ukrainians affected by the war in Ukraine. Many Ukrainian refugees will, uh, will wish to stay in Europe, closer to their homes. But we have also will welcome 100,000 Ukrainians to the United States with a focus on reuniting families. And we will invest $320 million to bolster democratic resilience and defend human rights in Ukraine and neighboring countries. We're also coordinating with the G7 and the European Union on food security as well as energy security. We're also announcing new sanctions of more than 400 individuals and entities, more than 300 members of the Duma, oligarchs and Russian defense companies that fuel the Russian war machine. In addition to the 100,000 U.S. forces now stationed in Europe to defend NATO territory, NATO established, as you already know, four new battle groups in Romania, Hungary, Bulgaria and Slovakia to reinforce the Eastern Front. 